What up, y'all? T Biz in the house. We got another Eagle Force figure to check out from Fresh Monkey Fiction. This one is Maverick, Eagle Force Mega Strike Force Leader. That makes me think of, um, he gives me, um, what was it, like Delta Force, like uh, Chuck Norris vibes, man, for sure. All right, and, um, and maybe, uh, was it Barry Gibb or one of the Gibbs from uh, from the Bee Gees? Maybe that, that kind of vibe, too. Anyways, or not Andy Gibb, but yeah, I guess it would be Barry Gibb. Or one of the Gibbs. Anyways, but uh, Global Premier Strike Force to fight world or worldwide injustice and tyranny. I can try to read, man. But anyways, uh, yeah, this guy looks kind of cool, man. Kind of cool, kind of sexy. Not going to lie. Anyways, let's go ahead and read his bio. And let's look at all the other figures I missed out on. Woo! I missed out on the Gorgils, man. That sucks. That's a Crimson Moon Aquatic Trooper. I missed out on Leon Kelly. That dude looked badass, like Shaft or somebody like that, man. And uh, I don't know. I don't know if we can get the Legionnaire. And I don't know if we can get Count Iron Moon. But yeah, I don't. Those will probably be easier to get. But that Gorgils, yeah, you can't find him anywhere. You can find some dude or somebody selling just a card by itself without the figure on eBay. I don't know why the hell you just want a card. I want to buy the card. Doesn't have the figure, but I want to buy the card, man. That's just stupid. Anyways, um, okay, Maverick, Mega Force, Strike Force Leader, Team Affiliation, Eagle Force, Mega, Cyber Era, 1990 to 2001. All right, actor Larry Gosling found himself starring in the Eagle Force Mega Syndicated TV show. Ah, oh, there you go. Uh, masterminded by Zapper, not just to raise funds for the real Mega Team, but also to divide, divert attention from their existence. Oh, that makes sense, man. Uh, during a fateful mission against uh, the cybernetic riot. Larry was inadvertently thrust into action during a mission and emerged as their savior, embracing the role he adopted, the codename Maverick. Maverick's uncanny infiltration uh, abilities stemmed from his unexpected cunning or perhaps his winning smile and charm. So there you go, man. That's freaking dope. Anyways, uh, yeah, let's bust this guy out. Check him out. Here he is. Maybe, maybe Charlton Heston vibes too, man. Maybe Charlton Heston. He's got the American flag right there. He's got a spandex suit. He's got the same boots, I guess, as uh, Captain Eagle, but they don't. There's no cut. He's got a rocker pivot swivel. Legs on. Can kind of almost do a splitsy. Not really. Not much on the waist at all really there's a little bit of there's a little bit on some of the waist but not much my other guys don't want to do it that they, i don't know I'm not, I'm not gonna bother with it i don't need him to do crazy waist stuff uh his arms go out there's a hinge and a swivel all about you got an elbow and a twist at the elbow and you got the up and down hand and a swivel right there and you got double knees so yeah there you go there you freaking go man uh yeah pretty freaking cool check out all the details that's freaking rad man so i guess maybe chuck norris very gib uh charlton heston vibes man i guess that i guess that would be it but yeah nice apps man nice sculpt too man even on his drawers on his booty man you can see like the stretchiness or whatever but yeah man Pretty good sculpt, man. Even the back muscles and all that, dude. So that's pretty freaking dope. Badass. Anyways, um, yeah, let's check out all the gear he comes with, man. Big old bag of gear. Hells yeah. We got three different heads. So we got like a we got like the um Halo type head. We got the Secret Ninja style type head. And we got just the other like in disguise, like regular white dude head. So there you go. That's awesome. And uh, we'll look at those a little bit further. Here's this little computer thing. There you go. I need to know more about him. What's with the cyber thing? They took got turn. Did he get turned into a robot, man? I don't know. Eagle Force stand. He's got a beret. Eagle Force beret, gold beret. He's got some cool ass guns. So that's freaking dope. And then he's got another pistol. Looks like a laser pistol. Maybe for the TV show or something. And he's got a side holster. Oh, what was that? He's got a holster for. Uh, his belt, and he's got a slew of hands. So there you go, man. Got those little nubs to add little accessories on his waist. So there you go. And a little ringlet. It's like a Fitbit or something, man. I don't know. Here's Maverick. Um, I'm gonna have him all gussied up now in his gear. Uh, here's the other head portraits that he came with or whatever. So 
there's like the ninja guy, scorpion guy or whatever. It's freaking dope. It's when he's like doing like covert ops shit or whatever, espionage. Here's the other white, white guy. White man, Caucasian man. Could be like, um, like a British dude or something, man. I don't know, like, I don't know, it'd be cool, man. I don't know, like Face, you know, like Face. Who, who, I thought, well, did Face do disguises? He was an actor on A Team, but I always felt like Hannibal did most of the disguises, like weird disguises on A Team. Anyways, I'm gonna shut up. But uh, here's the Halo helmet or Halo esque style tech helmet. So there you go, man. It's got different gear for different occasions. But uh, maybe he looks like, um, was it James Brolin too, maybe? I don't know. Let me know in the comments. What do you think Maverick looks like? He's, he's a badass, dude. I like him. I just figured we'd stay true to the card, what he's, what he's decked out on the card. When you give me different glove hands or nothing like that. But he's a badass, dude. This guy's rad. Totally 80s vibes. Total Delta Force vibes, man. Total cheese ball. Uh, 80s vibes, dude. Just rad. I put his little Fitbit wristband thing on him or whatever. His little, uh, whatever, um, was it Lance Armstrong? What was that dude that used to ride the bike? Uh, little, 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 you know, everybody wears those little bands that say, like, you know, beat breast cancer or, you know, eat barbecue, whatever it says. I don't know, but yeah. Live strong, tough, hard, whatever, in America. Yeah, but anyways, yeah, this figure's dope as hell, dude. This guy's rad. I like him. I like the silver paint on his gun, man. That's freaking dope. And he's got the little laser gun. Yeah, he's, he's freaking badass, man. Anyways, we'll do the good old size comparisons and uh, be done with this video, man. You know, and for size comparisons, here he is. It's kind of sloppy, but you, you get it. Here he is to high toy next to the Cobra Trooper from Hasbro Pulse. Um, high Toys Robocop and the Ninja robot warrior from delta 77 figures anyways and um yeah man and if you haven't seen um these before just scroll down go to my videos and scroll down to hit the delta 77 figures man and then just watch you some vids man because these are some badass figures i think you can still get them pretty cool man pretty nice little o-ring style figures a little like got the same articulation as like the old vintage leonard cores and um vintage joe's Anyways, uh, yeah, let's sort of look at uh, good old Maverick from Eagle Force Fresh Monkey Fictions. Anyways, uh, once again, thanks for watching, y'all, and uh, more coming up, man, because I got nothing better to do. All right, later, y'all.